Okay, when talking about computers, you will also run into this concept of resolution, which is a measurement of the quality of an image. Um, we'll get specifically into what it means. But just understand that the word resolution will have to do with the graphics or the pictures that you see. Um, in order to understand that, you first need to know that a pixel is one tiny square of light on a screen. All right, and your screen, whether that's a cell phone, a TV, or a monitor, is made up of many, many pixels. They're, they're, they're all lined up in rows and in columns. So you can see this picture down here that shows rows and columns. Um, and when the light is on, or when it's off, you know the pixel lights up. Of course, there's color and other um, technology used to make that possible. But for right now, just get the idea that pixels are just little lights of squares that light up on a screen. The number of pixels that you can cram into a space or that take up a space that is called resolution. So going back to that word, resolution has to do with how many pixels you can fit into a space, both vertically and horizontally. So all together, if you were to count all these pixels, what would be the resolution? So I'll give you about five seconds. Tell me what the resolution is of this particular screen if it were uh, a screen, length and height. Okay, hopefully you came up with your solution, right? You should have come up with resolution of 10 by 10 because 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 uh, uh, horizontally and 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 vertically. So uh, this has a resolution of 10 by 10. Of course, the quality of these images probably aren't going to be that great, right? Here are some other common resolutions. So if you see something about 1280 by 7020, that would be 1,280, right, of these. We only have 10, just to give you an idea, um, in one direction and 720 in the other direction. At that resolution, you're talking about HD. So this is pretty much TVs have 1,280 little pixels in one direction and 720 in the other. Altogether, that's how they make those crisp pictures you see on TV. 4K, you're bumping that up. Look. You could compare them 3840 pixels by 2160 pixels so they're getting more of these pixels in a space uh, a monitor computer monitor probably the one you're looking at right now is probably operating at 1920 by 1080 and the cell phone just to give you an idea um, this cell phone I think was for a Samsung uh, 1440 by 2560 right so that's those are the resolution. So now, like, okay, um, I understand that it's a count of the number of little squares of light you have. So how does that matter? Well, let's just go back in time when things weren't that great. You probably recognize this character, right? Especially the gamers out there. That's Mario from Mario Brothers video game. Um, quality wasn't that great. So, of course, the graphics weren't that great. Things were kind of um, really old and clunky. But... Moving forward, we're able to do more with more pixels, right? Because the resolution increases. So, key thing to keep in mind is resolution measures how many little squares fit into, um, or you can fit into a space. And it's usually, well, you will always see it as two numbers with a little X to tell you one side is this amount, the other side is the other amount. So, in this case, 10. 10 was one side. So, 10 pixels going on one side and 10 down the other. And put them all together and you can get total number of of actual pictures but together that idea is resolution higher resolution equals higher quality because you've got more pixels to play with